here we go. Chain battle season is here. Now, I, you know, I, I could do memes and <laughs> hilarity about chain battle all day long, but remember, the rewards for chain battle are actually very good. Um, and if the chain battle is not going to be annoying, which this chain battle shouldn't be annoying, um, then I, I, I don't really have much of an issue with it at all, right? Like, we know what to expect from chain battle. It's easy. You could hop in, get a decent score, do literally one run, and pull in a lot of rewards. Um, I do think chain battle is way overhated, considering you really barely have to even do it to get incredible major rewards, right? So... Uh, the enemy here, we're going to be going up against Great Ape or Giant Ape Kid Gohan. Uh, Space Traveling Warriors, Low Class Saiyan, and Power of Wishes. It's Power of Wishes, right? Yeah, Power of Wishes are the three uh, special categories here, um, which are going to allow us to do extra damage. Uh, we have a bunch of Turlises in here, Turlises Henchmen, um, a bunch of sort of like, like Saiyan Saga era Gokus. I mean, we do have some Namek Gokus in there as well. Um, and then also some Piccolo characters. Uh, oh, wow. Wow, dude. There's, these are high scores. Yeah, because uh, like I was saying, it's this is a good chain battle. These are easy f for players to have characters. Let's actually switch over and take a look at Misaka's chart. Um, but this is going to be a good chain battle because I think it's going to be very easy for a lot of players to have these characters. So here, of course, is Misaka's chart. Um, they always make these you know, very well done here. So, we want to go for base form Gokus and Kaioken Gokus over here. Again, like, free-to-play, 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 free-to-play. Sure, he's a summonable LR from last year, but then you're a Bandit from 500 years ago. You're a Dokkan Fest from 500 years ago, right? And then it's, like, free-to-play, free-to-play, right? Like, it's easy. Um, some of the Turlises certainly could be a little bit tougher, but, I mean, EGL Turles, who looks like the number one option here, he is a very long-time character. By the way, it looks like... EGL Turles is the strongest attacker we want to use, huh? Okay. So, I'll probably run Turles as our main attacker, and then we'll use the Dokkan Fest Physical Turles as our main connector here. Um, I think you're probably going to be better off if you would have two Easy Aid Rainbow EGL Turleses would probably get you the highest score. I think 1%, I probably can just use this Physical Turles and we'll be good to go. Okay. Not really a problemo there. So let's go ahead and build our lineup. <clears throat> I'll just make it, again, according to Misaka's chart right here. All right, so let's just go Pure Saiyan, Goku Family. That should be enough for uh, to get us a lot of the Gokus we want. So let's go to Physical here. Uh, so version Z Goku, Dokkan Butoden Goku. We want the TUR version Z Goku, which is right there. Uh, we want the SSR for Dokkan Butoden is next. Grab him. Uh, LR Kaioken Goku. Let's go ahead and grab him. Uh, then Tech Kaioken Goku. Let's grab him. Uh, then we want Namek Goku. Grab him. Uh, and then a bunch more physical characters. Now, physical Kaioken Goku, I do have him rainbowed, right? I did manage to rainbow him? I do. Yeah, physical Kaioken Goku. I believe he's one of the last ones. I actually got rainbowed the world tournament once. One of the last couple. Uh, next, we want the third anniversary free-to-play character. Um, and then... Oh, really? The next character, it's actually the SSR Goku. Even above the EZA. Okay, sure. We'll, we'll go ahead and grab, grab that. So we have... Uh, there's our super class lineup right there. So now for the extreme class lineup, we could just go ahead and hit uh, Pure Saiyan and Movie Bosses right there. Okay, so let's build our Turlises. So we want EGL Turles right there. And let's go ahead and grab Great Ape Turles while we're there. And SSR Turles, we'll also want him. Okay, and then we want the two physical Turleses. They're both good right there. All right, now let's grab the Int and STR Turleses. So we'll grab him. Uh, looks like we might not actually use the Int SSR Turles, so let's hang tight on him. Uh, we want both of these guys. Well, no, we'll grab him first. Let's grab Tech Turles right there. Let's grab the AGL Grid Ape Turles SSR. Um, oh, and then actually LR Turles, really. I guess because of his high stats. We could do either LR Turles or this one right here. I, damn, I'm tempted to just grab this guy. I, I guess maybe LR Turles just because of the really high stats would work better. I'll just follow Misaka's chart. I won't act like I'm going to know better. Let's grab Mis uh, Turles right there, bam. Okay. 
So these should be very good lineups. Again, should be pretty easy to hit top 1% uh, with similar lineups like this. All right, so here we get to my least favorite part of this, which is me squinting my eyes and really, like, looking in close. Like, okay, because remember, with these Gokus and Turlises, every character is going to look exactly the same, right? So it's like, all right, let's do a little squinty action. All right, we'll do Turles here. All right, here we go. Uh, I mean, that, oh my god, that's... That's an insane lineup. But this is better. Dude, yeah, this is like... This is a joke. This is... This is actually a joke. This is gonna be so easy. Okay, so we want to use version Z Goku as our main um, connector. Yeah, okay. Perfect. Okay, if we can get a nice... Wow, that's, that's not a bad Turlis lineup. Could we do better than that? Maybe... Um, oh, brother. I think... I think we could get a really nasty opening score right here. So I think I'm actually going to pause the recording. And I'm really going to try and use my... Ooh, there's Dokkan. We have, so Dokkan Fest Turles and EGL Turles right there. Probably would be good. What is the physical Turles? Probably 55%, huh? Yeah. Do I do that? We I, I we probably would just want the rainbow stats. All right, I'm I'm gonna find a sufficiently good lineup, um, and we'll we'll come right back. This looks like this is gonna probably be a very good score right away though, which uh is definitely a W. All right, guys, I look through and I think I will settle with this. All right, so we use physical Dokkan Fest Turles. Now again, uh, I could quickly can I just show this? So look at AGL Turles' stats right here: 20, 18, and 13, and then this guy. Is that 21, 13, and 13, right? So you can see that AGL Turles' stats, right? It, the difference is the attack. Their defense and HP aren't really different, which is... It, that is crazy by the new Dokkan Fest Turles, that he has easy a Dokkan Fest level HP and defense, but his attack is, you know, 5,000 lower. So it just makes AGL Turles um, the superior chain battle character because of that, right? Uh, which is good. It, it's always a good thing that, you know, the old... For Chain Battle, that the older character is better. And EGL Turles, I mean... I, I don't want to say he's super easy to get, but he is a Dokkan Fest from five years ago, right? Okay, so we're probably going to want to go, I think, like, the version Z Goku's here. Uh, should, should I go for version Z Goku's or Turles's here? Uh, so it's, it's, it's what? Space Traveling Warriors, Low Class Warrior, and Power of Wishes? I'm, I'm actually not really too sure. I think either would be fine. We have a very good Turles setup right there, but we also have the best possible, we have the best possible Goku lineup. Version Z Goku, ba uh, Dokkan Butoden Goku, and then STUR. Let's go with that. Bam. That, that's the best possible super class lineup we could get right there. So I think that probably should uh, work pretty well. Um, let me actually double check. Is Dokkan Butoden Goku, if he's that high up on Misaka's chart, he must have Power Wishes, right? I actually don't know off the top of my head if Dokkan Butoden Goku's on Power Wishes. I don't know. 158. We saw some scores a little bit higher than that. So we could definitely do a little bit better. But I mean, that's got to be an easy top 1%, right? And again, th this is how we know that this is a good chain battle right here. Because it's like, first try, we get a score like that. As long as people can pretty easily get 100 million, then I think Chain Battle is actually pretty good. Because again, you just do one attempt. Yeah, Dokkan Butoden Goku is on Power Wishes. Okay, I just had to double check that. Okay. So, all the Goku, most of the Gokus, most of the Turlises, they're both on two different categories. So, I don't even know. It would it would come down to stats, right? Whichever character has the highest stats. It's probably the Gokus is the best way to go about it. Oh, uh, look, look at this. Dude, Chain Battle is a bit of a W there. We'll take that. Oh, a 3,000-day player. Look at that. Wow. Let's take a look at their profile. A 3,000-day login uh, player. That's awesome. I, I am still quite a ways away from being able to get this 3,000-day title. 3 million power level. Beast Gohan. Okay. And they got Super Saiyan 2 Gohan as their header right there. Good looking profile though. 3,000. I mean, I can't do that, right? 3,000 days, W. All right, so this should be an easy top 1%, right? Like, what? What? Oh, wow. I didn't even get top 1%. This, this chain battle is this competitive. That's not even top 1%. That's crazy. 
All right, let's go back in. Let's take a look at a couple of these scores then. I think what'll happen is I am getting into this pretty early. As more players do the chain battle, the score will drop. This probably is going to settle into a top 1% score. But right, right here at the start, it's not. Now, I, I don't think that there's really any mystery like, oh, how are we going to get top 1% or anything like that. Let's take a look at this one right here. Oh, they use version Z Goku as their main attacker. I, I don't know that there's really going to be too much difference between Turles and version Z Goku, though, right? Can I see? Uh, uh, I should look at version Z Goku stats and compare it to Turles. Uh, I'm looking at the Turleses there. Both Dokkan Fest Turleses. I went for the Rainbow Stars. Maybe I should make sure to go for the second, even a 55% Turles. Can I see this Turles? No, damn, I'd love to see if this is 55% or not. Okay, um, so 168, let me take a look at the 167 right here. Yeah, the Goku lineups, oh, we have a Dokkan Fest Turles and an SSR Turles, okay. 165, ah, uh, all, all these top scores, yeah, okay. Uh, again, I, I was just thinking that maybe going for, like, I don't know, like the STR free-to-play Turles Rainbow might be a little bit better than the... Dokkan Fest physical turtles at 55%, but I think that's definitely not the case. I think if I would have gone for one of the lineups that had uh, the physical turtles at 55%, actually would have given us a higher score. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm not concerned at all. This is going to be an easy piece. Film Red! We got one piece promotion right here. Let's see. Uh, physical turtles. Yeah, so as you guys can see, these lineups are all looking pretty much exactly the same. Um, I think one reason we don't see any physical Turleses in here is probably because most people don't have them. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. You know what I could do, though? Because notice a lot of these a lot of these players actually have two version Z Gokus. I guess I could do that. Because I do, I mean, I have, I have over 100 version Z Goku. Yeah, watch this. Hold on. Let me show you guys one second. All right, so here's version Z Goku. Um, his stats are actually a little bit lower than Turles, so I think Turles is the best attacker. AGL Turles, yeah, AGL Turles' stats seem to be a bit higher. But, uh, I have, uh, a few. <laughs> I have a few copies of LR version Z Goku. <laughs> All right, well, there's Chain Battle. Uh, let me know what you guys think. This looks like a very awesome Chain Battle to do, though. One that, it's like, our literal first run, we get 158 million. Looks like they went from... Literally the worst ever chain battle, the Shen chain battle, right? Into the best chain battle ever, which seems to be this great ape kid Gohan chain battle. So I don't know what you guys think. Uh, thanks for watching. Woo -hoo -hoo! I'll take that. Uh, and I'll catch y'all next time.